This is my fourth week of getting an Imperfect Foods delivery. I can't wait to open up this box and see what's inside. Counter cooking. No kitchen, no problem. When I placed my first Imperfect Foods order about a month ago, I wasn't sure if I was really going to like having fruits and vegetables delivered to my house. I've always been the kind of person that's pretty particular with the fruits and vegetables that I pick out at the store. It's like I always want the freshest. I always want to look around and see what's what's new and what looks really fresh and vibrant. So I wasn't sure I would like other people picking out my produce for me. However, it has been so incredibly convenient and I feel like I'm getting more of a variety than I would buy uh, going to the store every week because, you know, I want to rush in, I want to rush out and uh, this gives me some more flexibility with that. And by having these deliveries every week in this box, it's always the same size box, it has helped me to get more organized. So. Uh, Imperfect Foods is all about um, cutting back on food waste and packaging waste and uh, recycling. So what I've been doing with these boxes is when I empty them out, I then fill them up with stuff that I want to get rid of, with stuff that I want to donate to a thrift store or stuff that I want to give away to a family member. So it works out really good because my box arrives on the same day every week and then I have an entire week to fill it up with stuff that I no longer want or need or use and then the next week it starts all over again. Also, by knowing I'm getting my box on a Monday afternoon because that's when they've been arriving, uh, like today, I cleaned out my refrigerator a few hours ago because I'm like, oh my gosh, I have a whole big box of stuff arriving. I have to make sure I have room for everything. So it's helping me keep uh, my refrigerator more organized, my kitchen more organized, and my entire house. It's helping me declutter my entire house. So how great is that? So let's open up this week's box. I have about twice as much food in this box as I normally do. So uh, let's check it out. Wow, look at that. Everything is looking really good. So the first thing I have here is a bag of Shameless Pets Catnip and Chill Crunchy Cat Treats. This is digestive support packed with pre and probiotics. Uh, it says it's upcycled with sweet potatoes. It's all natural. I don't know if the cats are going to like it, but I figured let's give it a try and see if they do. And I have some bok choy. I haven't had bok choy in quite a while. I love using this in stir fries. Also soups. I have a little baby avocado. And it's imperfect because it has some scarring on it. But it's super cute. And here's aroma tomato. It's very cold. And here we have some organic rainbow carrots. I really enjoy rainbow carrots. And I don't know why these are imperfect. Maybe because of the size, they're a little bit small. Um, but I will enjoy these. I have another bok choy. And I have some dandelion greens. These are looking really good. Now these are organic dandelion. Last week I had um, organic red stemmed dandelion. So it was a little bit different. And these look a lot fresher uh, than the ones that I got last week. I enjoyed the ones that I got last week. Um, I cooked them the following day. Um, I made them with some white beans and some salami. So it was like greens and beans and they were ridiculously good. They were so good. I actually posted the recipe on this channel. So if you want to check it out, just look for the dandelion greens and beans. They are so good. So I got these. I'm really looking forward to doing something similar with these. I got a big bunch of Italian parsley. And I got another cantaloupe. So last week's cantaloupe was really big. It was like 
like this big. So this one is smaller and this one is a bit soft already, like right here. So I'm probably going to use this one up really soon. I still haven't even cut into the one from last week because it was nowhere near ripe when I got it. So we'll see how this is. I also got a small head of cabbage. I got a green bell pepper. And I got a purple bell pepper. I haven't had a purple pepper in a very long time. And look at this. Look at that. Look how imperfect that is. Isn't it awesome? Then I got two navel oranges. And I have to say that the navel oranges that I've gotten from Imperfect Foods, I've gotten them two weeks in the past, have just been incredible. They've been some of the juiciest and sweetest navel oranges I've had. And then I got a pound of red onions. I love red onions when you slice them really thin and put them in salads, they're so good. And I got a bottle of this Primal Kitchen Ranch Dressing and Marinade made with avocado oil. And it says that this is paleo friendly and no soy or canola, which is very important to me. I always look to see what kind of oil a salad dressing is made of. And I hardly ever buy bottled salad dressing because it's always made with some kind of oil that I don't want. This also says no dairy, which I'm really interested in. I don't like consuming um, dressings that are full of dairy. It's also sugar free. So if we look at the ingredients really quick, it's avocado oil, water, apple cider vinegar, egg yolk, sea salt, distilled vinegar, gum acacia, guar gum, cream of tartar, onion powder, garlic powder, lemon juice concentrate, nutritional yeast, parsley, chives, dill, black pepper, and rosemary extract. So I am really looking forward to trying this. I don't think I've ever had this uh, before in the past, and I'm gonna be really curious to see how it tastes. And I got another English cucumber. And here are the rest of my Roma tomatoes. I think I've been getting Roma tomatoes almost every week. And uh, I've been enjoying them in salads and also I've been cooking with them. I got two lemons and I got a pound of California peaches. These are cute little peaches and these are really firm. So I'm going to let these ripen up a bit. So this is all of the fresh produce that was in my Imperfect Foods box this week. Let's take a look at the prices. So I got two lemons and they were 98 cents total, so they're about 50 cents each. The English cucumber was $1.79. The one pound of Roma tomatoes was $1.75. The organic rainbow carrots were $1.95. The one pound of peaches was $1.75. The navel oranges were $1.50, so that's about 75 cents each. The cantaloupe was $1.99. The avocado was 89 cents. The Italian parsley was $1.49. The one pound of organic red onions was $1.79. Uh, the organic green bell pepper was 89 cents and the conventional purple bell pepper was 79 cents. The organic baby bok choy was $1.99, and the conventional green cabbage was $2.50, and the organic red dandelion greens were $2.79. Now, I just read that they're supposed to be red dandelion greens, and these are not the red ones, but that's okay. I'm fine with either way. Um, the primal Kitchen Ranch dressing was $5.99, and the cat treats were $3.49, so it came to $34.32, uh, and then $4.99 for delivery. So for a little bit less than $40, I got all this produce, I got the ranch dressing, and I got the cat treats. So yeah, I think this is awesome. I really enjoy uh, being able to get produce that I'm not gonna see in my local stores like the purple bell peppers um, or the dandelion greens or the organic rainbow carrots. So I'm really hoping that Imperfect Foods uh, has more and more of that kind of stuff because I really want to try to get more variety. And the nice thing about it also is there's no packaging waste. I'm not dealing with a whole bunch of 
plastic bags and stuff like that right now. So if you think you'd like to give Imperfect Foods a try, I'll put my promo code in the description below this video and also I will pin it as a comment. And right now, if you click through on that code, they are giving you $20 off for four weeks in a row. So that's a total of $80 off your first four shipments. That's a really great deal. I wish I got that deal when I signed up, but I didn't. Uh, but now it's available. So if you've ever wanted to give them a try, now's a really good time to do that. So I hope this video was helpful for you. If it was, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to this channel if you'd like to see more videos like this one. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.